Hey guys, hope you all are doing well tonight and I'm coming to you with another Dollar Tree haul. Sorry if the camera gets shaky. I'm on my bed and I've kind of got it positioned on my bed, but it looks like every time I move it's going to bounce. So I apologize. Um, but I wanted to put this up here as soon as possible so that you guys can hopefully find some of the great deals that I found today. Um, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start. Sorry, I'm trying not to move too much. So if I look like I'm moving in slow motion. And you're going to hear crinkling. I apologize. Okay, um, so I wanted to go to pick up more stuff for the Easter baskets that I'm putting together for my two daughters and my great niece. Um, so I got some of these Easter picks. I'm sure you guys have seen these. Um, I thought these would be really cute inside their basket, so I picked up one of those. Then I got some of the aluminum foil sheets. I like these and that they're already pre-cut for you, so I grabbed those. I'm so sorry. I hope this shaking doesn't get totally annoying. Um, the next thing I grabbed were these carrot Easter eggs. I thought these were, well, Easter carrots. I thought these were really cute. Grab those. And I got some of their heavy duty, heavy duty plastic cutlery in the pink. I thought this was really cute. My birthday's coming up in a month and we always have little family gatherings, um, at the home that my grandfather lives in. So I decided to pick up some stuff for that. And I grabbed some of these plates. And it's a 14 count. I thought those were really cute. We'll probably end up having a lunch together and stuff that day. So I also grabbed the dessert plates that match, shaped like a little flower. And then the napkins, 16 count. So I grabbed those so that we'll be all set for that. Okay. Next, I found, whoops, sorry. Um, next, I found the Gain Fabric Sheets. I was on the hunt for more of these because I had a bunch of coupons. So I did get them for 50 cents a box. And I picked up five of those. Then I also found the Suave 24-Hour Protection Deodorant and Everlasting Sunshine. I got this for my daughter. I don't know if it's any good um, or what, but I saw it there and it's a, a 2.6 ounce. So I thought that was pretty good for a dollar. Then I also grabbed the LA Looks uh, Extreme Sport Hair Gel and it's an 8 ounce. This is one of my favorite hair gels, so when I saw it there, I decided I'd grab that. Next, I got the NOLA Honey Almond um, Hand Soap. And my store always has these. Actually, both of the stores in my town have these um, all the time. And I've tried this before, and I like it. Um, I like the lemon, the lemon Verbena better, but they were all sold out of the hand soap in the lemon. So I just grabbed one in Honey Almond and then I also found this uh, Hello Kitty mouthwash by Firefly and this is going to go in my niece's, uh, I almost said my niece's stocking. <laughs> Christmas is long gone. Um, in her Easter basket. That's what I meant. Okay, and next I grabbed the Nani's Biscotti Bites in the Classic Almond. I haven't tried this particular one yet, but I have tried the Biscotti Bites in the um, Caramel Milk Chocolate, and I love these. These, not good for me to have around, because, yeah, this is the second time I've purchased. And, yeah, I really like them. So if you see them, give them a shot. Okay, next I got the Colgate um, Fresh Mint Toothpaste. This one's for ages 8 and up. And I had coupons 
um, which made these 50 cents a piece, so I grabbed four of them. So I got those. Okay, then I grabbed the TGI Friday Potato Skins, the Jalapeno Cheddar. My girls really like these. Then I grabbed the Double Bubble Cotton Candy, and this is for one of the Easter baskets. And I grabbed some of the Beer Nuts Original Peanuts. My husband likes these. And I got some Campbell's Home Style Mexican Style Chicken Tortilla Soup. And this is a 14 ounce, and I bought this before, and my daughter really liked it, so I just grabbed another. Next, I got the um, the popcorn kernels, and it's a 16 ounce bag, and they are non-GMO and gluten free, and they're 100% whole grain. Um, so I grabbed one of these. My good friend was telling me today because she went shopping with me, um, and she let me know that. She just put some of these in like a little paper lunch bag with some, she said sometimes she'll put a little bit of olive oil and some garlic salt and throws it in for like a minute and a half, two minutes. And I didn't know you could make um, popcorn like that in just a regular paper bag. So anyway, I love fresh popcorn. I grew up with a popcorn popper, so, and I haven't had fresh pop popcorn and I can't tell you how many years. So I grabbed that and I'm going to give that a shot. Then I got the Mike and Ike cotton candy and it's a five ounce and I grabbed two of these for Easter baskets. Then I grabbed one of this, uh, it's a three quarter of an ounce uh, whole cinnamon sticks. I didn't see the other pack that the, that has a lot more in them. I've never seen them at my Dollar Tree. These are the only ones that I see. Um, so I'm going to do like an apple cinnamon thing on my stove to make the house smell nice. So I'm going to give that a shot. I haven't ever done that before, but I've seen a lot of people do it. So I'm going to try that. And let's see. Yeah, I did some little bit of damage this time. Um, I got a two-pack of the Super Putty in the eggs, and it looks like it glows in the dark. Yeah, glows in the dark. I got these for my niece's uh, basket. Then I got the Reese's Pieces peanut butter eggs, and it's a 3.5 ounce box, and I got two of these for the baskets. And then I found the um, Hello Kitty eggs with the candy inside, the four pack. This is also for my the Easter basket. All this candy and stuff that you're going to be seeing is all for the baskets. Um, I got this Charm Super Blow Pop four pack. And these are some big suckers. So anyway, I grabbed one of those. Then I also got the Lifesavers Hard Candy Spring Mix. They're individually wrapped. It's a 3.2 ounce, and it comes with raspberry, strawberry, banana, and watermelon. And I really like these. Um, my store had these over a month ago, and then they disappeared for a while. So I decided to grab one since I saw them again. Then I got the Whoppers Mini Robin Eggs in the 4 ounce box. Robin Eggs and Whoppers are my favorite. I absolutely love malt, malt, malt ball eggs or malt balls. I love them. And I got the Assured Antibacterial Travel Wipes and it comes in a 3 pack. Each one has 10. I really like these. And I bought them in the bigger pack before, and they are one of my favorites. Um, so I decided to get these since I can put those in my purse. And I grabbed the Deli Quality County Line uh, Shredded uh, Mozzarella Cheese for the pizzas. 
my girls are going to make some of those pizzas. Then I grabbed the uh, Little Dutch Made Deluxe Cream Cookies, um, and this is actually a 10-pack. We uh, really liked the um, regular package that they have that's not individual, and um, we tried those a couple days ago, and they were really good. So I decided to get the 10-pack that I saw there today. Sorry for all the crinkling. Okay. Now these... Only one of my stores has these, and I haven't really seen these around much, but they're really good. I grabbed these for the baskets. Um, Russell Stouffer. This one has three dark chocolate and coconut eggs in the pack. And it's a 2.25 ounce pack, so I grabbed that. And the next one I grabbed is the Russell Stouffer uh, three marshmallow eggs, and it's a 2.25 ounce. They're milk chocolate covered eggs. So I grabbed those. I think we're definitely good in the candy arena. <laughs> okay, now these I saw in right in the aisle by the aluminum foil and they're Jiffy Foil brand and it's the 13 by 9 cake pan but it has a pink lid. And they also have it in purple. I thought that was really cute, um, so I can transport the dessert that we make for whether it's my party or Easter or whatever. I decided to grab that. Okay, then I found the Barbie Cotton Candy uh, Scented Detangler. I've never used this before, but I know that a lot of people um, have hauled it and really liked it, so I grabbed one for my niece and the other one for my other daughter. She's got long hair. So I grabbed those. Okay. Next I found a two pack of Brush Buddies My Little Pony uh, toothbrushes. I thought those would be really cute for my niece's uh, Easter basket. Put it up here so you can see the there image better. Um, they also had it in Transformers as well. Um, so I grabbed that. Then I found some makeup. Um, this is between two different Dollar Trees that I went to both today. Um, I've been seeing this for a while and I haven't hauled it, but I decided to grab it for one of my daughters today. And it's the Physician's Formula Shimmer Strips and the Smoky Hazel Eyes. I know probably everybody has seen these. Um, anyway, I grabbed that. I don't know why, but I just didn't want to have it for myself. I wasn't interested. But I figured she may like that. Next, I found some Milani Shadow Eyes. And I'm really excited because I've only found one of these in the past. And when I bought it, I didn't really know if it was any good. So I haven't been able to find them since. Um, I found the shadow eyes in the espresso line which is 08 and let's see I got three of them anyway really uh, deep dark espresso brown can you see that anyway um, I got three of those then I also found the shadow eyes in the 11 sand dunes, and I grabbed three of these as well. They had all the colors. They had teal, purple, um, I don't even know if there's a green. If there's a green, then there was a green. But we don't really use colored very often, so I didn't think that the girls would use it, so I didn't bother. Um, next, I'm... Totally embarrassed to say that I really don't even know what these are. <laughs> but they look like they're lip glosses or something for your lips. And I grabbed them. They're L'Oreal. They're called Hip High Intensity Pigment. So I'm not sure if that's for your eyes, for your lips, what the heck it's for at this moment. But um, I found this one is in color. or It's in number 180, which is called oh my gosh I can't see is it sw swanky 
I, 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 you guys. Yeah, I think it says swanky. My eyes must be really getting bad. Anyway, this is what it looks like. If you guys know what the heck this is, let me know. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll probably be looking it up online. Anyway, so this is what the back looks like. I don't really know. Anywho, um, yeah, so, and now that I'm looking at it, it says L'Oreal Paris on the back. Do you know that I had coupons? I probably could have got this for free. I didn't even see the Paris until now. Oh, well, okay. This next one I got is in the 280 Chic, 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 well, I don't know how they pronounce it. Um, if you can kind of see here the difference between the last one. Anyway, it looks like these are by L'Oreal Paris, so if you have the coupons, go get them. Uh, this one is number 480 Snazzy. Anyway, I thought those were cute. Um, so I grabbed those. Oh, I just put them back in this thing. I also got the two-pack of the little baskets, too. Okay, so I've got one bag left. And this one was at a second Dollar Tree. Okay, so I got a bag of the Double Bubble, the regular size assorted gumballs. Then I grabbed the Profusion palette in Smoky. I haven't picked this one up um, yet, so I saw it there and decided I'd go ahead and grab it. Then, okay, now this I saw on, on Aaron's channel, is it what, the green, the green cabbie room? Oh my gosh, if I totally just messed that up, I apologize, I'll put it down below. Um, she showed this in one of her hauls, and maybe it's just the green cabbie. Anyway, I'm sorry, Aaron. Um, she hauled this, and it's supposed to be a version of Paris Hilton. And I smelled it, and I don't think it smells exactly like Paris Hilton, but it still smells nice. So I got this, I'm going to throw that in one of the baskets. Then, I got the Soothing Nature Garden Sleep Aid 8 Cherry Flavored Tablets. My husband likes these. He said they were good. So I got those. Then I grabbed... One of the Glade Solid Hawaiian Breeze, and I grabbed this because Lala from Lilybug Lane here on YouTube had hauled it and said that it was a, a must purchase. So I grabbed one, and then I grabbed another um, another thing of the Spaha's uh, Skin Relief. I had hauled one of these just uh, last week. And so I grabbed another. Then I found the Hello Kitty Dial um, antibacterial hand soap, 7.5 ounce. My store had a bunch of these and I had never, um, I couldn't find them the last time they went around. So I grabbed that. Then, okay, I found these things by L'Oreal, and they're sheer, shiny lip glosses, and I don't know the color, I can't see, like, what it's called, but this is what it looks like from the front, and they were not there at my Dollar Tree yesterday, so they just came in. I don't even know if you could really see the coloring there. It's like a um, the the it's like a deep pink, and so I grabbed that, and then I oh wait, I think I might have grabbed two of the same, you guys. No, this one's a little bit lighter. This one's just a tad lighter. From the out, from the front, it all they all look the same. So. Hopefully you can see they had like four, no, like five different colors. 
this next one here is more of like a deep, deep burgundy with some shimmer in it. That was the darkest color that they had there at my store. And then the last, wait, is this the last one? Yeah, this is the last of the lip glosses. It's um, kind of like a bronze, like a light bronzy color. Or Anyway, really cute. They have a bunch of them. And um, hopefully you guys will be able to find those at your store. Then, I also found the Milani Liquid Eye in the Graphite number 6. And I found three of them, so I bought all three. Sorry, I can't like see where I'm aiming. Anyway, I've never used these before, but it says it's a liquid like eyeliner pencil. All day wear smudge proof. I don't know, we'll see. So I grabbed those. Then last but not least, and I am so sorry, I completely forget. I, I can picture her face um, of who just hauled this and was talking about it, but I'm totally brain farting on your name. So I'm so sorry. Um, I will also link down below. But um, she had bought the Lusty Organics uh, Olive Oil Detangling Spray. And gosh, I just watched this last night too. It's, uh, she said that it worked really well. It's anti-frizz and detangles. Well, I found it, so I'm going to give it a shot. Um, because I have really thick hair, um, and it's always getting tangled, and it's really curly, so I figured that, uh, hopefully that it worked for me. Okay, you guys, I'm so sorry that this is so long. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you're having a great night. And I hope you're able to find some, sorry, this won't keep moving. I hope you're able to find some great deals at your Dollar Tree. Okay, you guys, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.